How to use Applic for print on demand. Hey everyone and welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you how to set up Applic and how to actually go ahead and start using it. Now, if you don't know, Applic is basically uh, a platform that is going to be helping you with your print on demand uh, business. So basically, you can just connect this to your Shopify or Etsy um or other stores and you can just use it for print on demand if you're familiar with printify or printful it's pretty much the same idea so to get started is going to be very easy and simple you'll need to just navigate to applic.com you can see on the screen right now applic.com from there you'll need to just basically create an account in here in this website to get started so we can just go ahead and click on sign in and create our account from here. We just click on create account and then we just go ahead and set up our account. It's going to be a very simple account creation uh, process. It's not going to be any different. So I'll just skip ahead and get back to you once I'm done. So once you finish up your signing up process is going to take you to this page once it says start creating. Now you can just go ahead and start uh, doing this step, but what I prefer to do is actually go ahead and connect uh, my store to it as the first thing to do. I will be using Shopify for this example or in this video, but it's going to be pretty much the same way for different services. So I will just go ahead and navigate to, to my Shopify and get back to you once I'm there. And I'll show you how to actually connect your Shopify store as well to Applic. For some reason, my Shopify is taking too long, so I will just take the time to show you one more thing that I forgot about, and this is very important. Uh, once you log into your app and create your account, you will need to go to your profile picture right here on the top right, uh, and go to these settings, go through them. So basically, you will need to go to pay methods, set this up, make sure you know you actually get paid, uh, and then from here, you'll also see all types of things like save designs, approves. Uh, approvals uh, orders subscriptions and more stuff like your stores once you actually connect them did it load in yet i don't know what's going on to be honest anyways so here you can just go ahead and set up your profile anyways since this loaded in uh what you will need to do to actually connect your account and connect your shopify store to your applic uh, basically click on add apps and just navigate to your shopify app store and you will need to basically search for Applic to in the Shopify App Store and just install it. So let me just do so real quick. Print on demand Applic, it's this one right here. Just click on install. And we can just go ahead and start designing after we connect our accounts. So we just again confirm our installation. And this is going to basically allow us to connect our accounts uh, and it's just going to do the work for us. So let's just give it some time. In the meantime, let me just close out of this. Let's just keep this. Okay, I'm just going to... Okay, there you go. So now, if we actually go to um, store, we can actually see our store, Shopify store, is now actually in here. Uh, so now that we're in Applic and we have already got our Shopify store connected to Applic. Now we can actually go ahead and get started uh, on creating our products. We can just go to the home page and start your design. And here we can just go ahead and select what type of design we want to work on basically. So we can just go to um, streetwear, for example, and let's just go for hoodies and we just click on view more and you'll be able to browse all sorts of hoodies that we have uh, i mean in the menu here so we can just select whichever one that we like uh, let's just go for this one for the sake of this example so i'm just going to click on design hoodie and you can see the price points as well in here and the types of colors that it supports so we can just cl click on design hoodie and it's going to take us to the designing page. So here we can actually go ahead and select the colors for it. So we can select navy, black, or whatever color we want for it. 
before we even get to the editing part, we can actually go ahead and scroll down and you will see a lot of things here that are very important. You can see the description. So make sure you understand and read through the description because at the end of the day, you will also need to describe the product that you will be selling. Uh, the benefits here as well, make sure that you add them, futures and so much more. Not only that, you can actually go ahead and order a sample. I will show you how in a sec. And from there, you can examine it and actually talk about it yourself. So just select the color that you want to edit. So we can just choose this one for the sake of this example. And then we can just go ahead and add your artwork. Click on here and we can just go ahead and add the artwork that we want to add. I'm just going to use this one for the sake of this example. Uh, make sure it's a PNG. If not, it's also going to allow you to remove the um, remove the background. So let me just use this. It's a PNG, so it's not going to be necessary for me to remove the background. You can see here, remove white. So if the black background is white, you can actually remove it from here. But no need for me. So it's it's already for some reason super small but anyways let me just go ahead and adjust it to my needs like so so just feel free to adjust the logo or whatever you want on your clothing you can also adjust the back uh, and if you want to add your artwork on the back you can do so and same goes for sleeve so um I just get to your designing parts here you can add your sleeves uh logos and stuff uh, and you can just go ahead and copy this descriptions of yours here from shipping and fulfillment all of those things it's also going to show you the shipping time and price u.s shipping price and days here international shipping price and um time basically so just make sure you get the entire information that you want to get Afterwards, we can just can uh, clo go up, click on next, and now we can select what we want to do with it, whether buy a sample, which what uh, I just recommended you to do, buy in bulk, which does affect the shipping. So you can see bulk order over one hundred dollars is going to be free shipping in the U.S. and is going to take one to five days. Uh, or you can just uh, drop ship this product uh, through one of these stores that you'll be using. So we can just click on this one and we can actually just adjust the pricing. If I can just, there you go. So you can actually adjust the pricing on the bottom here. So you can see the price, the cost, and then the profit. So you can see the profits here. You can adjust the price. You can make it uh, higher or lower depending on what you want to do. And then we can just go ahead uh, and be done with it, basically. So we can just uh, create a new product, uh, give it a name. So we can just keep it as it is. Uh, and obviously, make sure you adjust the entire thing, the name and the description. I don't really need to tell you about this. Make sure you make it engaging at this. And at the same time, just list everything that you know about the product. And we can just click on save. And it's going to show uh, put all the images and stuff and it's going to pretty much just add the product to your store and now we can just go ahead and continue designing or edit products in the store uh, and we are pretty much done this is how to use applic uh, for your print on demand with shopify etsy or what type of store that you want to use uh, if you want to add another store, you can do so by just going to settings, going to stores, and you will be able to add a store, give it store name, and then just continue on with the uh, list or the steps and stuff. And by the way, as you can see, here you go. This is the same product. Uh, once I go to products in uh, Shopify, it's going to be in here uh, waiting for me. And it's going to be exactly the same. As we did the price is going to be the same the title and the description are going to be the same and we can also feel free to edit them within the store if we didn't like the editor in here and we are pretty much done I don't know why it's taking too long for Shopify to do anything today I have no clue what's going on but I assure you that it is working and it shouldn't really take too long for you I, I just think my Shopify has some 
server problems or something. Anyway, so this is pretty much how to use Applic for your print on demand. I hope you liked this video and thanks for watching.